Ladies and gentlemen, the weekend. And then this is my favorite, yeet. It's yeet. used to express surprise, approval, or excited enthusiasm. And yeet the verb is actually my very favorite, to throw, especially with force and without regard for the thing being thrown. Yeet it. You yeet it. <laughs> and then if you're really happy, you go yeet. yeet. Yes. I like yeet. You can yeet it and then yeet. Shrinkflation. Nice. <laughs> Don't start real. I get the... Do you see what happens here? I get blamed for things. I did nothing. You're right. Thank you. It's been a long week for you. <laughs> I gotta go somewhere I'm loved. Oh my God. Because it ain't here. <gasps> shrink. Yeet. <laughs> I just got yeeted by Maria. <laughs> Over shrink shrinkflation of all shrink things. Shrinkflation. I'm always behind. Several models behind. I when still. It comes to this. I, I, I just got rid of my flip phone. <laughs> really? We have a landline. <laughs> Before the flip phone, I had cans and a string. <laughs> but the people want to know, how you holding up, Heather, out there in the heat? Oh, let me tell you. It is a scorcher out here. It's like a sauna and blow drying your hair. But you know what? Our producer, Michelle, look at this. Ah, that's, that's the good stuff right there, guys. Our producer, Michelle, she sent me to Southern California with this trusty little travel fan, and it has come in handy, let me tell you, because it's hot. But unless you're in the shade, it kind of feels like you're just blow drying yourself constantly because it's in the 90s. Lots of Bills tank tops, a little too hot for the jersey. But uh, you know what, Bills fans, we're, we deal with the cold and the snow for so often that we'll take a little bit of heat. For sure. You're in one of the best places to be right now. Heather, you look fantastic. And of course, great <laughs> shout out for producer Michelle. <laughs> Always got our backs. I enjoyed that when Heather asked the owner of that one bar, how much? How much beer? Just a lot of beer. <laughs> Just a lot. I like that. That's what I'm going to start saying. How much beer do you have in the fridge? A lot. A lot. You got to do it seriously. A, a lot. lot. <laughs> How are you? A lot. A lot. <laughs> Wally! I love that name. Wally! Wally, courtesy of Diamonds in the Rough. You had me with the music, that's all I can say. <laughs> we are in the studio, no dogs in here right now. Hey, it's time for Mostly Interesting. Maria, come on down whenever you're ready. I'm coming on over. <laughs> I'm gonna start. <laughs> Go ahead. Really, what I wanna do is just be able to travel. Go anywhere? Yeah. We, no one's stopping you? <laughs> <laughs> I know, right. You can. I should start right now. I was looking at that van life, too. Yes. I was always, I, I, but I, that might get old pretty quick. I feel like I had a conversation about van life with Scott Levin. Oh. <laughs> Can you just imagine if we all had a van and just hopped in, <laughs> took I this show on the road? Yeah, I could not see Scott Levin vacationing in a van. In a van! I'm telling you, right? That's never happening. I, I mean, I don't care how luxury that van is. That's <laughs> just not for our guy. It's just not for him. But it would be a great way to see the country, wouldn't it? Yeah. Well, we were discussing, Mary Alice and I were discussing about how you would not be suited for van life. For van life? Yes. What do you mean van life? You mean like just traveling around in a van? Living in a van. Why not? Camping. Why not? Why not? Listen to this one. <laughs> Why not? I love to camp. Pitch a tent and all that stuff. Oh, yeah. That's, I mean, it's one of your favorite things, yeah. I know. S'mores and all that stuff. I'm an avid outdoorsman. <laughs> you, listen, you're not the only one. You and your husband out there with your coffee by the lake. I'm going to get my camping gear and I'm going to get my van and I will have video for you. Miss Kate, that you can show. We'd like to remind you, Scott, Marie, and I, that we heard you use the phrase yesterday, pinch a tent. <laughs> you had to bring that up. I couldn't help myself. I knew I avoided that because your memory is very good. Well, you know, you gotta be you careful around here. You pinch a tent. <laughs> you don't pinch the tent. Right. Pitch it. We love you, Scott.